Hi everyone, here is Alexander and um, it's almost 4 in the morning, I cannot sleep, um, I will have to wake up in 6 because I'm, I'm going to, to the work, but never mind, and uh, today I'm, I'm not gonna be testing um, any antivirus or internet security suite, it will be test of um, one very useful program that can also help you in um, in battle if I can say like that, in battle against uh, viruses and uh, other nasties and that program is called Komodo Time Machine and uh, here is the main interface and it's developed by Komodo obviously <laughs> um, it's a free program and that's good uh, here is the installer 18.6 megabytes not a huge installer and uh, it doesn't use a lot of RAM um, it uses um, about uh, 11, 12 megs of RAM I think maybe 15, I, I'm not sure but totally but um, it's pretty light and um, when you when you install this program it makes a snapshot of your system you can choose whatever you want uh, it can make it can makes um, a snapshot of your C or your of your C or D drive or E you can choose and um, it's called baseline as you can see and uh, let's say if something goes wrong that something goes wrong and uh, you can uh, restore your system to to that state so everything will be back to normal also you can make uh, snapshots whenever you want you and you can call it however you want now I will make one snapshot because um, it's totally clean system right now and um, this snapshot will be I don't know um I love Komodo. There is no space. Okay, I love Komodo. I do love Komodo. And you can make um description over here. And just click OK. And there it is. Here is my snapshot. And it says you're here. And this is the baseline. And um let's say on the you are on the internet and um, you got infected your antivirus um, perhaps didn't uh, recognize that that nasty malware or something like that or you don't use antivirus program let's say like that and um, you got infected your machine is screwed up and uh, you don't know what to do um, let's say you cannot even boot up your your windows or and you cannot um, boot up into a safe mode let's say like that and uh, you have um, you don't have many choices you only have two choices you can uh, you can use your bootable city and clean that um, nasties or you can uh, reformat your hard, hard drive and um that's that's nothing that that is not that uh, you would like to do of course because you will lose your your data your uh, files your settings uh, games and uh, programs of course and um if you have komodo time machine you can fix that i will show you that right now I will close this window. Uh, over here I have some uh, viruses over here. A lot of them. I will run some I will run some of them and uh, after that uh, I will reboot this machine I and I will show you how to use Komodo time machine in um, let's say it uh, pre-bootable mode before Windows uh, loads up. You can use this uh, program and um, let's run some of them here is the process explorer let's run first and there it is in the memory 
and the next and one let's run this eight <laughs> and the uh, fake Adobe Flash player as you can see a lot of processes over here run this one and the file too set up it's very infected right now as you can see and um, it's very slow let me pause this for a second alright everybody as you can see my PC is totally freezed and locked up I cannot click anywhere and um, I cannot restart my machine so uh, now I will force a restart and um, I'm gonna show you how to how to restore your machine to previous state And then let's go to um, power reset. Yes. While this is loading, you will need to press uh, a home key, home button. Now and uh, there it is. <laughs> Restore system. Take snapshot. You can ju you can uninstall software from here if you want. And now I'm gonna uh, restore my system to uh, to a snapshot called I Love Komodo. There it is. Now snapshot is loading. Let's wait for this. Come on, sixty six per cent. I guess it's done. I don't know. Hopefully, and the Windows XP. This is a um, service pack too, by the way. I do not, I do not using, uh, I do not use Windows Seven because, um, as you might know, um, exploits doesn't work on Windows Seven. At least some of them. I'm not sure about. Um, PDF exploits or Java and uh, let's see everything should be back to, to normal I will run a scan with um, Hitman Pro just to make sure that everything is ok there it is Windows is starting up let's make this a full screen welcome and there it is Everything looks normal. 
for now. Let's see. Maybe it's maybe it's not. I don't know. There is no pop-ups. <laughs> Let's wait for this. I'm gonna pause this for a second. Hey everybody, I'm back and um, as you can see everything is uh, perfectly fine. And uh, I'm gonna show you in Process Explorer. Uh, there is no malicious processes running over here and um, everything is just fine and I ran a scan with uh, Hitman Pro and uh, infected objects nulla <laughs> zero <laughs> nulla is on Serbian sorry and um, zero infected objects and uh, that's great to see uh, I highly recommend this software because um, it's very good, it's a free program, it doesn't use a lot of RAM memory and um, I also use this software you can combine this software with your antivirus and um, that should be a nice combination so everybody thanks for watching, uh, please comment, rate and subscribe and um, see you soon and have a nice day bye bye